EA Sports coverage of the NFL brings us to the heart of Texas and the very wonderful AT&T Stadium in Arlington. A moment ago, here was the scene with the Cowboys emerging from their tunnel. It was loud. It's still loud. We're ready for football as the Cowboys get set to match up with the Seattle Seahawks. This is taken near the 13. And he'll return this one all the way out of the other side of the field. But that return gives him a golden opportunity to go out in front. How will the defense respond after giving up that type of a return? down pass play, second and three. Now the first carry for Ezekiel. And a nice little start as he's able to get this up to the 28. 13 yards and a first down, Cowboys. So after a good run by Zeke, another first and 10. Throwing, Prescott completes it to Jason Witten. And he'll be a couple yards shy of the red zone here at the 22-yard line. A gain of six there on first. That's a staple of this offense. Drag route to the tight end. Yeah, he's unable to use his size to break off much more yardage after the catch, but still an effective gain nonetheless. They'll bring out four receivers, three of them being sent to the left, one to the right, second and four. Prescott to throw. They'll try and set up the screen. It's complete. So the screen good for only two, now it's third down. In order for a screen pass to break big, a lot of things have to come together and be well executed, but all it takes is one small thing to go wrong and keep it from being a big game. Here's Prescott, and that's knocked away and incomplete. Not only was the call spot on, how about the execution of that defense right there? The zone was absolutely locked up tight, he was trying to force it in there on third down. But if there's a time to force it, he felt like he needed to make a play, right? Yeah, exactly right. Third down, you got to try and find something. There's nothing available there for him. They'll run him with Elliott. And try to push his way forward, but I think he's going to be short. And he is short. Ezekiel Elliott not able to get it past the marker. And on the opening drive of the afternoon, the defense forces a turnover on downs. Wilson and the Seahawks take over now, first and 10 at their own 19-yard line. Let's go, let's go, double count right here, double count. Check, that, that. This is the Oklahoma State alum, Chris Carson. And not a whole lot to speak of there as they'll bring him down shy of the 20. Just a yard on the first down carry, so it's second and nine. And here's second and nine, just a yard on that last run. Wilson, flushed out right. That's complete to DK Metcalf. And they'll get it all the way up about five yards shy of midfield. A first down there on a pickup of 25. Check. 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 55. Slam, slam, slam. Check, 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 check. Go, go, go. go. Here's Rashad Penny, first carry for the former San Diego State Aztec. And he's got this one across midfield in the Cowboy territory. Eight yards on the pickup, and now they'll have some options on second and short. On second down, here's Penny. And he's corralled 
but not before getting it inside the 35. That one good for 14 and a Seahawk first. So they'll come up first and 10 now from the 33. One left, one left. Check 49. Watch twins. Watch twins. Hey, look three. Hey, zero, zero, zero. Now Wilson. And a completion to Wilson. A gain of six there on first. Let's just break this down and make it pretty simple. Key to the drag route, letting the play develop, finding the hole in the defense, and giving your athlete, yes, athlete, a chance to make something happen once he has the ball in his hands. Six yards was the pickup on the last completion, so here's second and four. We're scoreless after one. Point up and through by Myers. And that makes the score 7-0. After the touchdown, here's Myers to boot it away. That's fielded in the end zone. Take it back to about the 19 yard line. The Dallas offense here set to begin the drive. And on the last drive, they were in field goal. They just opted not to kick it, didn't get it. How does that change the mentality of this goal? I don't think it changes much for the head coach because this is what he preaches all the time. Attack at all times in any spot on the field. And he likes touchdowns, not field goals. Now, your field goal kicker, you've got to make sure you nurse him through and say, OK, don't worry about it. When we need you, you've got to be ready to go. And the team, of course, loves to see points on the board. So let's see if it changes a little bit in the same spot again. Well, we'll see what the decision is here if they get to that spot. And he'll be taken down, but not before he works it past the 50. It's a gain of 16 in the Dallas first down. They ran that one well, and not only did they pick up a nice chunk of yardage on the screen, they sent a message to the defense. Rush the passer all you want, but you better be careful. We can hit you going back the other direction. Here's Pollard. And he picks up about six as he gets this down to the 41. Let's talk a little football 101 here because one of the keys to advancing the ball downfield, success on first down. Huge difference, as we know, between second and four and second and eight and nine. The last run got six, now second and four. Now Prescott. Got his man there to complete the gallery. And he's going to get it down to the 33-yard line here. Seven yards there and a first down. I like watching the wide receiver screen because it's a real teamwork play. Because guess what? The guy catching the ball, he'll get all the credit. But how about the people up to block in front of him, either fellow receivers or offensive linemen? That makes that play a really nice timing play, and sometimes it can break big. So they'll come up first and 10 now from the 33. Here's Elliott. And nothing doing. He's immediately taken down at the line of scrimmage. Very, 
No gain on the play there. Second down. Officially nothing on that last run. They'll try again second and ten. Second quarter action with 1.59 remaining. Coming up at halftime in a little less than two minutes, we'll send you to Orlando where Jonathan Coachman is standing by. He'll have highlights and analysis of this first half. And a double coverage and it's intercepted. Picked off by Quadre Diggs. And he'll be brought down at his own 10-yard line. Cooper was the target there. Coming to the line here to begin their next drive, the Seahawks offense. They have to be thrilled with that first drive they got in the touchdown. Now they'll be looking to make it a two-score advantage here on the road. And you know they spent all week in practice in meetings talking about taking an early advantage. Being the road team, going up a score, that takes the crowd out of the game and puts some doubt in the minds of their opponents. After the interception, here's Wilson. He's got a rifle on deep left. Oh, well, this is taken in. It's complete. The 20, 10, and all the way in. Touchdown, Seattle. Russell Wilson with two first-half touchdown passes. And the Seahawks get the quick strike touchdown. Well, this is exactly what I expect teams to take a shot. Right after a turnover, you count on the defense being a little bit jumbled coming out on the field, maybe catch them back on their heels, and that's exactly what they did there. They threw it downfield and really created a big play. Yeah, you said jumbled. They were the definition of jumbled defensively. One play and into the end zone. And the decision to bring it out will cost him about five yards as he'll get this only back to the 20. About set for this next drive by the Cowboys offense. Already down two touchdowns here in the first half. This becomes a pretty important drive, doesn't it? It certainly does, and a lot of teams script plays. We know that, right? They, they have a script to start the ball game, and typically those scripts go between 12 and 24, 25 plays. Down two touchdowns early, probably not very deep into their script. I think that they'll stay with it. I don't think they'll abandon it just yet and try and generate some offense on this drive. Anything, at least three points get that zero. Nowhere to escape, and he goes down. Jadavian Clowney showing the explosiveness on the sack. Well, someone's been up to the task so far in this game. They are already up a couple of scores, Brandon, and guess what? I think they're just going to pin their ears back now and get the field get after the quarterback. It's up. And got his man complete. And they'll take it into the end zone for a Cowboy touchdown. Amari Cooper, 91 yards. As they are now on the board here in the first half. Forbath able to convert the extra point, and that'll make our score 14 to 7. Forbath to send it away now following the touchdown. That'll be taken in the end zone. And he's up past the 20 to the 22 yard line. Coming to the line here to begin their next drive, the Seahawks offense. Well, you're under a minute to go here in the half. Field position not really in your favor, but still time to try and move the ball and get in field goal range. Yeah, you've got the lead. It's a, definitely a thought. Let's go ahead and try and increase it. But at the same time, I don't like the odds. I don't like where they are on the field. Got the lead. They've done well in the first half. Don't mess it up and go into halftime looking at each other wondering what if. Now it's Wilson, eluding the pressure right. And he can't find a receiver, and he's brought down. Jalen Smith coming in hard that time on the blitz, and he gets him down. It's a loss of four. So after the sack, here's second and 14. Oh, yeah, I'm coming. Oh, yeah, I'm coming. They don't want to repeat a first down. They'll keep 
keep it on the ground. And he'll push forward here for a good little run as the clock continues to run. The Cowboys going to use their second timeout now as they stop it with 28 seconds to go in the first half of play. And it looks like we've got a dime set here defensively. Six DBs in the game. signal for their third and final timeout as the stoppage will come with 23 seconds to go till halftime and the punt team on now as this one sent away here's Austin a big boot that time 57 yards the official distance and control of the football switching hands with very little time remaining until the half The Dallas offense here set to begin the drive. And with time quickly fading here in the second quarter, not sure how aggressively, offensively they want to play this. I think we'll find out just how much they trust their guys in this situation if they decide to take a shot. And they'll be taken down, but not before he gets into enemy territory. First play of the drive, a success, 19 yards. So we have reached halftime with a touchdown. That's the difference on the scoreboard. As we send you to Orlando to check in with Jonathan Coachman at our EA Sports Halftime Report. Coach? The Seahawks with the advantage, and they get the football first as the second half is underway. And a fair catch signaled for and taken successfully. Coming to the line here to begin their next drive, the Seahawks offense. They have the lead now. They'll be looking for some separation here as we begin the third quarter. I like the way you turn that because now I think they go a little bit deeper into their playbook. They like what they did in the first half. And the Cowboys pressure gets there this time for the sack. Michael Bennett, the former Texas A&M Aggie, dropping the hammer. Well, partner, we know they came out of the locker room down on the scoreboard, but I will guarantee you the defensive side of the ball got super emotional. They can come out and play with aggressiveness, with fury, because they don't have to be quite as precise, and it paid off for them on that play, didn't it? Sure did. Excellent play, really setting the tone for this third quarter. A second down pass play there, but it's incomplete. Well, this at least is the right idea. I think they've got to get the tight end more involved. He had just one target in the first half. Incomplete, now incomplete here with the first target in the second half. Yeah, should not stop them at all from going back to him. Though. Find him. Find him. An incomplete pass on that last play, and that means they'll need to come up with something here on third down. Out of the gun. Here's Wilson. And that will be incomplete. You hear the calls for a penalty, but I just don't think so. I think in this situation, the defender was making sure his guy couldn't hold on to the football. So I don't see anything that warranted a flag. No, I'm with you. There was contact, but I'm happy they kept that flag in the back pocket. Now Austin. Nice job bringing that one back. 14 on the return. And the Cowboys will take over the football with a first and 10. About set for this next drive by the Cowboys offense. They trail offense, first time to touch the ball in quarter three, and we'll see what they can do. And I can't wait to see what they have planned.
because some teams script to start a half. Other teams just go, okay, these are the sequence of plays we want to run. These things work well for us. And sometimes they throw in that big chunk play right away. Shocker. Try and get after them early and try and create a big play to give themselves some momentum. We'll see what they have up their sleeve. Throwing again on second down, but this time it's incomplete. Now they face a third down and four after that incompletion on second down. Out of the gun, here's Prescott. He's got his target, it's Cobb. And he'll have it past midfield almost to the 40 before being taken down. His first catch, and it's a pretty big one. They get the conversion on third down. So from Seahawk territory now, it's first and 10 at the 41. They'll run with Elliott. He's got the first down here inside the 30. And he is into the end zone for a Cowboy touchdown. Ezekiel Elliott, 41 yards. As they are an extra point away now from tying this football game. For Bath, the extra point. And we are tied at 14. away this fielded a few yards into the end zone and no run back here this will be a touchback and it comes out to the 25 yard line coming to the line here to begin their next drive the Seahawks offense and a tight game after punting last time see if they can get something going on this drive as they head to the field now, with the game this close, you've got to feel there's a sense of urgency for them going on offense right now. But they have to do it without letting panic creep in and affect their play. Kill, 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 turn up. Kill, 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 turn up. On second and 11 now, Wilson steps away to his left. Looking left side, it's complete. He's got it. And they're able to get this one across the 35. 11 yards there and a first down for Seattle. On any given pass play, you never know exactly where your exit points are going to be. On this play, it was flushed to his left, still on the run, able to accurately throw the football for a nice first down. So from the 36 now, first and 10. Come on, gun, gun. Come get some. Come on here, come get some. He don't want it. Time to go. Time to go. Hey, hey. They snap it at one. Now Wilson, four stack to his left. He's got a first down and then some at midfield. And out of bounds on the other side of midfield at the 45. The coverage may be too good that time as he breaks away for 19 with his legs and a first down. So from Cowboy territory now, here's first and 10 at the 45-yard line. They'll run on first down. It's Carson. And he's corralled, but not before getting it inside the 35. It's a gain of 12 first down Seahawks. Under a minute to go in this third quarter as they come up first and 10. Here's Carson. The tackle there by Antoine Woods. Tough first half for him, unable to put up the numbers he's used to producing. But with a guy like him, you and I both know it just takes a couple of explosive touches for him to make an impact on this game and on the stat sheet as well. He's checking, he's checking, he's checking. Friday, 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 Friday. Say he's creeping. No, no, no. 25, check 25. Four down, four down. 
They just do get the playoff as he'll look to throw. Flush to his right. He's going to take off with it. So they'll get a little extra time to come up with his third down play as we play three quarters. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. The Seahawks on third down, just one for three thus far. This will be third and six. Check, check, lucky, lucky, lucky. Under 10, under 10, 10. To throw is Wilson. Being chased out left. This one into the hands of Metcalf. And he'll be out of bounds, able to get it down to the 25 there. Just a five-yard pickup, and it leads to fourth down. Tie game, fourth quarter, and they're going for this thing on fourth down. They'll try and throw it forward with Wilson. And he locates Luke Wilson. And he will score. Touchdown, Seattle. Making a hat trick for Russell Wilson. Three touchdown passes now. And the Seahawks have taken the lead. Myers connects on the PAT. And the lead is now 21-14. After the touchdown, here's Myers to boot it away. That'll be taken in the end zone. And no run back here. This will be a touchback, and it comes out to the 25-yard line. The Dallas offense here set to begin the drive, and they're hoping to redo their efforts in the last drive when they got into the end zone. And just think of what it's like now on the sideline, because when you score a touchdown, you have to go over and look at the tablet and see what you did on the last drive. When you score points, it's a whole lot better view than when you're trying to figure out how to fix things there. Four yards on the pickup. Second and six. At the 29 yard Following the pickup of four, here's second and six. Now Prescott. Now they set up the screen. That's complete. And he's taken down right at the 45-yard line. 27 yards there, a first down. That was a beautifully executed screen pass. Let the rushers get up field. The blocking forms in front. Lofted it to the runner. And now, not only does he have open space in front of him, he's got an escort as well, and they pick up big yardage. And he's tackled a yard short of the marker. Good gain of nine on first down. For a second there, I thought that might break big. Screen pass. Looked like it was coming together. Looked like there was an opening. Still ended up with a solid game. That last catch short of the marker by just a yard leaves him with a very manageable second and one. Elliott. And he works it to the 30-yard line here, right at the 30. A gain of five, good enough for the first down. I tell you, they didn't give it to him much for the first three quarters, but when they have, he's been efficient. Maybe they ride him more here down the stretch. Yeah, not sure it was actually in the game plan for him to have as few carries as he has, but it might play out really well for them now. As you noted, if they want to ride him down the stretch, he should have fresh legs. 11 yards and a Cowboy first down. I absolutely love the run right there. This guy's known for his quickness, but also for his speed. And he's able to get to the second level almost before you blink if you give him any type of blocking. Always talk about slot receivers. And they're usually known as quicker than fast. In this case, we've got a guy who's quick and fast, and he used it to great advantage. Shaquille Griffin in on the stop defensively. That's a good play by the guys on the defensive side of the ball. Held him to a gain of two. And that changes the playbook a little bit now for the guy calling plays. Second and eight. Now he's got to probably think about going to the air instead of maybe staying with the ground game. From the 17, Prescott firing quickly here, and that's complete. 
And he'll go down here at the 12-yard line. That catch good for five. It's third down. Fourth quarter, down to the final two minutes. And we've got a one-score game. So the Cowboys in possession of the football here as we get you reset. They face a critical third down now, needing a score here in the late goal. They're able to convert on third down, and that sets up a first and goal. Some good strong running right there, some power and some explosiveness just about got him into the end zone. A looming decision to make on the conversion, down seven, but first things first, they need to score as they come up on first and goal. And they'll get him down just shy of the goal line at about the one. It's a gain of a couple, and it'll be second and goal. To me, that's a terrific run on first and goal with the three. They got two yards. I'd line right back up and give it to him again. One man in the backfield. That's Elliott on second and goal. They'll give it to him up the middle. And he'll get in. Touchdown, Cowboys. Ezekiel Elliott. His second touchdown of the afternoon as they can now tie the game with the extra point here in the final two minutes. The extra point, a vital one, and he gets it to go. And, partner, we've got a tie game here in the fourth. A couple of teams locked into a good one here. 21 all the score as the kick's away. The Seahawks take over the first half Let's go. Coming to the line here to begin their next drive, the Seahawks offense. And they had to wait a long time to get the football back. Probably not what you were hoping for when you got an offense that's on them. Agreed. What you were looking for is the defense getting the ball back pretty quickly, right? Hoping for a three and out. So that didn't happen. You can't yell at your D for that. They've got to take care of their own business and reestablish themselves now that they're back on the field. 25 yards there on the catch and run. Seahawks going to use the first of their timeouts as it'll come with 36 seconds to go in half number two. on that last carry. Here's second and seven. Wilson to throw. It's caught. Lock it. Four yards on the completion, and it sets up a third down. It drives some people crazy to see those short throws underneath. They've got to find a way to gash the defense downfield. I spy a couple of extra defensive backs on the field for Dallas. Cowboys in the dime on third. Hey, check 24, check 24. Now Wilson. He'll find that cap. And he's got the first before he's brought down at the 39-yard line. And now we'll get a timeout here. They're able to stop it with one second to go in this game. So now this one will rest on the right foot of Jason Myers. This from long, very long range. Does he have the distance? He does. It's good. My goodness, he hits it from the parking lot as time expires. And they'll be celebrating in Pioneer Square tonight. The Seahawks have won the game. Well, a little drama there at the end, but really this thing was already decided. The late points get scored, and then it ends.